Welcome to another episode of Master Corp, where we're talking LED systems. And in particular, in this episode, we are going to talk about the helicopter LED system. The one in my hand incorporates a heli safe system. And this one that you basically buy as part of the ready-made helicopter LED systems does not. And making this fishable is as simple as taking your lead, attaching it to the speed link, popping it over, and there you have it. All sorted. It comes ready with a charge swivel with a quick change on the end. It also has the no trace bead system on. So this system is literally now ready to fish. And basically all I need to do is let me just take a, a rig here. And it is as simple as taking the end of an anti-tangle sleeve, popping it over the loop and just attach your hook link and pop it over and there you have it I'll just show you like that there you have a helicopter rig which is the safest system that in my opinion if this lead would get stuck the fish would pick up it would pop that no trace bead off and I'm not, not going to pop it over here in the garage but there it is the no trace bead just pops off literally just like that and that basically then allows the fish to swim free all the way until where your line would have parted leaving just a hook link in the fish's mouth that is the safest system in my opinion now let us focus quickly on the heli safe and I'm going to quickly put one together so you can see. Now the important part of this is when you open up this packet, please take note that there are two spare springs and two collars in the back of this packet. Do not forget about this. I have seen guys throw these packets away and that's a bonus for me because I love those little spare collars as well. And you sometimes do need a spare spring. So first and foremost, I'm going to take this out and just put it there. And then take out one of the heli safes. And just pop it out here. There we go. Now this heli safe actually has a little system that if you take it apart ends up with and let me just pop this out then you can see the whole lot there we go and from this side let me just take a thinner needle and just pop that little swivel out there there we go right there is the entire Heli safe taken apart. Now the first thing we do is I take my lead core and I loop to loop the little swivel, which is just a half a swivel. Just put it, pop it over like that. And then this is why I need the splicing needle. Or the stick needle in this case then I pop this unit over and I pull it all the way down so that the little swivel goes right inside that cavity the next I do is just slide the spring on whoops let me slide that spring on there we go and I slide the end cap over. Right. 
now I've got a system that is partially completed. Now, if I slide this part over and back in, I have got a system where I've got the ability to pop the lead on and when the fish would take and you've got pressure from that end you'll see that little door open and the lead will fall off but if you do not want the lead to fall off you just reopen this little cage and then you pop this little collar just onto the lead core because it's got a little a little opening where is that opening now there you go got a little opening and it just fits nicely on there now i can reattach the system but before i finish it off i have to add the lead like that then push it in and click it on now when i pull you see that little door does not open now this lead cannot be dropped now for the rest of it and therefore we need this lead core safety system the lead core safety system incorporates a chart sleeve a barrel bead and a no trace bead and there's quite a few in the packet so you can actually put quite a few together now i have taken some out already and there is your chart sleeve there is your barrel bead and there is the no trace bead so putting that together i need my stick needle and i just push that barrel bead over so I get to the end of my lead core. I always just wet it. It just, it just slides on so much easier. And then I just push it onto the lead core. And all the way down. So that it's just short of, of that. Now let me quickly show you the importance of this barrel bead. If I take the rig like that and the barrel bead receives a bit of pressure, it actually leaves that door open for the lead to fall off. And it also acts as a bit of a buffer. So it is important to have that on. Getting back to the rest, I slide on the chart sleeve now this is a little bit more tricky i sometimes have to use my my shirt just to aid it through there we go like that and again i take my lead core just wait it a bit and i just slide this back over like so get my shirt again there we go now I can slide this all the way down to the position that I need before I finish off the rig I take my size 11 quick change ring swivel and I just slide that over and over the chart sleeve and then I take my no trace bead and I just pop the no trace bead on like that job done and we've got a helicopter rig ready to fish and there we have it